The Broom Way, a path from Great Wakering Stairs to parts of Fellness Island is known with merit as the most perilous byway in England. During its chequered history, it's thought to have claimed the lives of more than a hundred unfortunate souls, washed away in the unforgiving North Sea. This part is around six miles long in total and is open to some of Mother Nature's less forgiving elements. From the fast tide that you cannot outrun and the current you can't break free of, to the cold waters that would chill the life from you. Not only that, the grey can kill you too. The stark grey mists that roll in from the North Sea. In the surreal curtain, any trace of high ground disappears and the sea, the sand, the standing two to three inches of water you are constantly sloshing through and the sky all become a uniform pale slate grey, a colour undecided and experimenting between light and dark. At that point, up, down, and any cardinal direction around you is indistinguishable from anything else. Many people have become disoriented and wandered off course. Just stepping off of the rubble strewn causeway that leads there will land you on the treacherous sucking mires of the black grounds, or as locals know it, the coffins. There is another potential killer, and it's not nature, it's man unexploded ordinance. Fellness Island is now owned by the Ministry of Defence and is operated by a private contractor for testing explosives and even aircraft ejection seats. The reason why you are looking at images from Google Maps instead of my drone footage is due to the security restrictions placed on the area by the MOD. Even filming from the ground we had to make sure no buildings are in view. When I spoke to the security at the entrance for Foulness about my intentions, I was informed about the strange lights they had encountered, such as odd lights, figures, etc. For more information about the Great Wakering Stairs and the Broomway, click on the link in the description. So what did we capture during our visit to this desolate part of Essex? Watch and find out. I am Adam. Welcome to South End Guy Paranormal. Can you hear me? Can, can you hear me? Yeah, that's why we're here. Can you hear me? <laughs> Hello. That's why we're here. Hammer. Hammer. Did he not come out with that Hammer. last time he was here? Well, I can't, I, you know, I can't even remember. Sure it did. Pat. Is that you, Pat? Sorry. Are you a man? Right, we, we've got a man here. Yeah. Yeah. John. John Bolt. At the moment, this is Tina's pendulum. All right, now I believe we have got John Bolt. Come and stand. What the f was that? Can you say that? Okay. So. Okay. So. Right, uh, good evening everybody, and as I explained in the intro, we've come out to uh, what is Wakering Stairs. Now, uh, as I also explained in the intro, this has been, well this area, um, has been a significant loss of life uh, due to the, the conditions and the, the um, it's just inhospitable here. As I say, I've explained it all in the intro so you know what you're looking at. Um, so basically we're here tonight to see if we can uh, bring anyone hell. forward, if anyone wants to come forward to us. Are you in hell? And um, we did actually, uh, Rudy, Paul and myself actually came out here uh, a few weeks ago. However, the weather turned very inclement, uh, very windy, very rainy, uh, so we had Thank to call you. it off. But tonight, hopefully, in better conditions, it's nice and dry, it's still. Um, Is there 10 people here? There's very little wind, hopefully no, uh, none of the wet stuff tonight. So uh, we're hoping we can, uh, we, we can get some uh, good content for you. Um, so we'll ask 
any poor unfortunate souls that lost their lives out in this area on the stairs on the on uh, the broom broomway that's what they call it uh, it's called the broomway because there's uh, a load of sticks which were marking the, the path and they look like brooms that's hence broomway um, we are asking any spirits that would like to come forward um, and give us a thank you a sign uh, come and talk to us we mean you know how we are friendly and we will help you if we can Anyone would like to come forward? There's um, a teddy bear there for any younger souls you. that may have lost their lives. Um, and there was a little ball on the table there. If you'd like to touch it to give us some sort of acknowledgement that uh, you'd like to come yes. forward. And there was also a little black box just by my torch. Um, that's only there to give you energy. None, nothing here is designed to hurt you in any way, shape. Thank you. You're welcome. Has everyone got their phones turned off? Well, it's very turned off. Oh. It's in the car. <laughs> <laughs> well, I've had a 210 reading now. I was making sure it's not mobile phones. It's probably yeah. me. Mine's off. Thank you. I'll turn it off and uh, I'm not going to need it. Unfortunately, it's also pretty cold tonight. My uh, no. milk meter is saying 7.3 degrees. What do you uh, know? Coupled with the, uh, there, there is a slight breeze coming off from all the sea. Down, it's come down to 7.17. I'm lucky, I'm, I'm hiding behind Rudy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm big enough to vlog anything, I think. <laughs> Where's she going there? I've just been out there. Oh. Kitchen's not over there again. Yeah, there's anything. Well, I'll, I'll just. Thank you. Obviously, what we got last time, but. Yeah. I'll, I'll get flashes, you know, like of the the boy. Yeah. That run out when I was looking for his thing, but that's about it, really. Was it his? Uh, I think it was his sister. Was that the, the, the said it was like a golf girl. Yeah, uh, angel they call. That's it, angel. Yeah. Yeah. She had um, a, that thing round her neck, that um, like an angel uh, necklace thing. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and that's all I see really. I can still see it now, so. Yeah, say, so on the briefing count that we did manage to come out here, Rudy picked up um, a girl, she's probably teens. Yeah, in her early 20s, I'd say. Yeah, um, together with this little boy. So, as I say, unfortunately, because we couldn't stay long, uh, we couldn't really do a lot. But we're hoping tonight that we can I maybe... see you. Oh, well, that's good, because um, if you could maybe show yourself, um, you know, manifest in some way. Um, just to show that you're willing to come and talk to us. Um, maybe a bit more if you're feeling lost. You feel like you lost your way. You got taken out by the tide. Bogged down in that. Yeah, we got stuck in the mud. sand or something. Yeah, like just sand stuff. Also, um, I did have a conversation with the security when we came here before. And uh, they see, they've seen and heard odd things out here as well. Uh, some odd lights, voices, that sort of thing. So uh, we, we know the stuff that's gone in here. But as far as I'm aware, we are the first paranormal team to come out and see if we can pick anything up. Uh, that's just what we're hoping we can do tonight. Who's that? Sounds like a bird. Yeah, come over from that way. Might have been a bird. Is there any reason why you're this far up and you want to go further out? We could go further out. I don't think anyone's going to drown just here. No, it's no. It's like ankle height. Um, you can go where that um, post is. If you want. Yeah, we can go yeah. Well, that seems a little bit more sort of... If you want to go any further, yeah. it's down the individual. We'll go down as far as... Oh, look, look, as soon as you get here, 135. Hunger. Hunger. We're getting some activity now, Adam. seem a little weird to you because we're out here. Um, I asked a question, if there's any 
young ones, uh, um, children here, and it came up young. So I said, yeah. oh, how old are you? Waters. And said seven. And I said, can you tell me your name? And then it said Jackson. OK, well, that's good. Jackson, we are here for you. That's your name, Jackson, we are here for you. Leave here. Or not. My name's Adam. This is Rudy, Tracy, and Ricky. Please. Yeah. Half a mile out. Half a mile out. That's what she said. Well, I don't know what she's talking about. By the dockings. Tom, I can think of dockets is what we use for um just talking about um what the boats are bought to or something like that. Was your brother named Peter? Pete. No, no, it's uh, temperature staying 6.9. Pete, are you 13? What ghost bus contraption you got there? Uh, this is a millimeter. It's like EMF with that seems temperature. A, that seems right. Ten. No. Thirteen. Thirteen. Yeah. That seems. That seems about right. About that age group. That's like the brother's age. Yeah. 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 So the teddy bear's a bit too uh, young for you. Can you set the? Uh, you set the. I don't need to do it. Just touch it like that. Wait. Or on the teddy, if you do wish to use that. All we need to do is just touch them, they'll be fine. Was you held down by a weight? Ah, yeah. Voice. I was just going to say I can hear a voice. I heard a voice as well. But it was coming from behind us. Oh, well, it would be behind the camera. So, oh. It was a male voice. Yeah. Thank you. We just acknowledged you. Son. Whose son? You can come well, and stand next to me and give you permission. Wayne. Brilliant. Which? Get off my land. <laughs> yeah. Put a bee in front of it. I might be one of them. Yeah, I can vouch for that. Not a witch. <laughs> witch, witch. Bewitched. Bewitched. <laughs> so we've gone down to 6.6. Could you maybe come forward and touch my hand at all? Higher. 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 Well, I'll be here. Okay, I see come you. Forward. I'm glad you do. I can hear the bells. Yeah. We can bring you back to land. We can help you move on. And you don't like being out here. Should we go walking, Adam? Just beyond the post. Yeah, can do. About half a mile. Half a mile. <laughs> <laughs> I, I want to come back. I don't want to end up another st statistic. Statistic, eh? Well, at least we know your name. What is it? Adam. Mine? Yeah. If you get lost. Oh, yeah, yeah. We can, we can do an investigation. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> <laughs>
We've got no chance we can't remember his own name. <laughs> but a dime bar in? moment then. Dime bar. Bastards. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, talk to us. We're not trying to trick you or anything at all. We really aren't trying to trick you. Just but just like to see you come forward and talk with us, that's all. You mean you know how we no, just we wanna know what's happened to you? No we don't. Anyone that got lost on this path? can't find your way back, we are here. We can bring you back onto the path. Follow our voices. Oh, my ghost ship app's gone being quiet. Mm. It's never like that. I think Tracy's got a female one. Don't yeah. shut up. We asked it to make you a sandwich yet, see what happens. What the ghost tube have or tray? <laughs> Both. She said, I said, oh, I want some toast. And she said, oh, you go and make it. I said, nah, I've been at work all day, you ain't. And next one, no toast arrived. Uh, <laughs> got a real train, mate. Well, it's took her 30 years, but we're getting there. <laughs> I asked for toast in 1992 and it finally arrived. Did you shit yourself? Portrait. Portrait. Um, I don't know if I would shit myself. Part of me would love to believe there is an afterlife, but I've been doing this with Adam for a couple of years now. Yeah. And at the moment, I still haven't been scared. Not seen anything. No. I'm saying that I've never been scared. No. Um, one or two moments of apprehension, maybe. Yeah. Like Pluckley Woods. Yeah. Um, there's a there's a few things you could turn and say don't feel right, but I've not seen anything. Is there an Isabella here? Adam had a spell, didn't you, at the um, Horn Church? Airfield. Oh, yeah, yeah, that weren't good. That weren't good. No. I would say it was like, um, yeah. from Adam's point of view, you see, so, so it attached it itself. Yeah. But for me, I just thought he was always coughing, so I don't know if he had a f secret fag or something, I don't know. No, I didn't at that time. <laughs> <laughs> I just started coughing my guts up out of nowhere. Yeah, it, didn't, it wasn't well, you right. You probably got overshadowed. You reckon? Well, if it weren't, if it didn't feel like you, yeah. Mm. I mean, I've seen that. It de so definitely many. wasn't right. We just said to him, as we're walking by, I said, who's noticed? Off Adam's coughing a lot. Still didn't get us a drink or nothing, but, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I've, I've been, I was taken over, but, you know. Was... What car you got? Uh, Audi. I'm not surprised. <laughs> <laughs> so, so this cowboy works, walks into a German car showroom, Audi. Ba boom ah. oh dear. Your talents are wasted here, son. <laughs> they do get worse as they go along, uh. don't they? <laughs> Have you seen anything yourself, Rudy? I used to see things all the time. That's before I touched the old, uh, the Meister. The, what's it, Meister? But yeah, I, uh, I grew up with this. Yeah. This, uh... It's got a caution coming up over you. What's that mean? <laughs> Beware. <laughs> Sharon. Oracle. Sharon? I don't know her. Grandmother. Grandmother? I'd like to think that's mine, <laughs> but I say that every time. <laughs> Not too far. Are there any spirits with us tonight? You can cross fierce and open for no, please. I see yes. Yeah. Oh, right. Okay, thank you. Can you open Guardian. The <laughs> Just a guardian. That's me. Okay, can you open my rods, please? Can you open my rods, please? <laughs> I don't think he's taking much notice there. Can you open the rods, please? Could you open my rods back out, please? Yeah, that's it. Open. Yeah, that's it. Go on. Open. Thank you. It's just a guardian. 
I've just got to double check. Yeah, go for it. No. Is my guardian with me? All right, thank you. Bless you. Thank you. Okay, can you uncross them, please? Thank you. Thank you. Are there any other spirits here tonight, please? Any other spirits? All right, brilliant. Thank you very much. All right, can you open my rods again? These feel really light tonight. Mm. Been down the gym. <laughs> yeah. Working out. Good Been chance working to be a fine thing. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Is there more than one spirit here tonight, please? Oh, we've got 300. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. I don't know why it's not beeping at the moment. I don't even doubt it's getting whole lot. Can you uncross, please? Thank you. Yeah. Did you lose your lives out to sea? Thank you. Could you uncross, please? Father. Christmas. Could you uncross, please? Thank you. You feeling Rudy? Is there a female spirit with me right now? Don't be worried about. Thank you. There's a couple of them picking up. Mm -hmm. really, a boy, like a boy, definitely. Mm -hmm. Young spirit. Okay, could you uncross, please? We was having a conversation one day about um, being serious and larking around help. and fun mm -hmm. yeah. and what sort of response you should get. So we got, help. we got help. So one night we went out and lark, was like being larking around. Another night we went out and done a serious one. To see what sort of response you have got. Please? Did you? Was there any change? Yeah. When well, we're sitting there laughing their heads off, as a family, just joking around, sitting in the graveyard. Yeah, cross, yeah. please. The, the bloody gadgets just kept going off. It wasn't actually talking to them, just them involving themselves with us messing about. I think it's just fame of mind, you. Yeah. Come on. Well, cross, please. We just felt like they, they was happy to Uncross. talk to us because yeah. we wasn't being serious. And other times, you don't get no response at all. Yeah, that. She's not letting go. Sure, darling. Oh, can you open, please? Open my rods, please. Thank you. Thank you, sweetheart. Come on. There we go. It's okay. Are we talking to Angel? Well, that's a, that's a yes. All right. Okay. So, figure that one out. Thank you, Angel. God bless you, my darling. Okay. Can you open the uh, open the rods, please, darling? Thank you, sweet. Come on. God bless you. It's all right. We are all aware of you now. Mm. What would you like to see? Ah, um, uh, yeah, she's really close. Yeah. Really close. What would you like? Oh. Angel, could you point the rods to where you're standing, please? <laughs> Thank you, darling. Could you point my rods to where you're standing? It's just to your left. Yeah, it's just to your left. Angel, is Peter your brother?
Thank you, darling. That's thank you for confirming that. That's what I was getting. I'm sorry. Uh, it was a, a sensitive answer, a question to ask you, but we had to have the confirmation. I'm sorry, darling. God bless you. Okay. Yeah. Could you uncross my words, please? Did she say Pete was with it? With it? Oh, yeah. Did you uncross my words, please, Angel? It's very dis yeah, it's uh, quite distressing that one for her. Bless her. Mm. And him. Is he with her? Um, you can ask that. Okay. She'll tell you. Angel, is your brother with you, please? Is your brother with you? You tried to help. No. You tried to help. No. I'm not on it. Um, You're looking for him, aren't you? <sighs> All right, Angel. Could you let Could you let go of my rods, please? We can have a chat and see if there's anything we can do. Thank you. God bless you darling. Yeah. Thank you. Alright. Thank you. Angel, thank you. Um, right. She's looking for a brother. Right, stop. Well, you're yeah. out of battery now. Well, that um, certainly uh, Oops. clarifies what I was getting then. Yeah. That didn't last long. It wasn't really fully charged to start with, mate. It was. <laughs> well, when I looked at it, it, it was like less than half, half battery. Yeah, but they, they tend to do that, don't they? Some, sometimes you're out on investigation, they drain your batteries, don't they? Yeah, I'll take them. Is that that one? Yeah, she's um, coming for a really strong now. It's very close. I usually get a warning sign here. Um, See, like I said, I'm a, I'm a non-believer. I mean, you, you're you're getting signs, let alone none, none of the equipment's going off. So no, uh, sci well, scientific equipment can't sometimes can't. You know, you wouldn't get anything. Yeah. As I say, well, I'm going out with Adam. I've got all this equipment, and like I say, I'm yeah. just trying to I'm trying to believe. But Wait. say again. The water's coming back in. Yeah. That's seeping. Yeah, sometimes, yeah, you have to see it for yourself. That's yeah. that's the only belief, really, I think, you know. Well, I've often said, go with your gut. If, you, if it doesn't feel right, yeah. just go with your gut. Well, I'm, I'm clairvoyant anyway, so, mm -hmm. you know. Uh, OK. I'll go on feelings anyway. Yeah, I can yeah. hear it. Right. But we're on the causeway a bit, Trey, so we're a good couple of feet higher. So we've got plenty of room. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'll go for a swing. Let's go. <laughs> oh, no, no. How quick is that coming back? That is just... All right, we'll give it another five minutes. Yeah, that's trickling in, isn't it? All right, yeah. isn't it? All right, that's coming in really quick, actually. I think we better move back. For those who can't see it, see how quick the water's coming in? This is what this catches, is what catches, catches people out. Literally coming in that way. Angel, you can follow us. Um, and I feel I'm Ooh. quite sensitive. Yeah, I... Um... Oh, that is coming in. Yeah, we've got to move. Look, that's just literally covered the causeway that quick. Huh? Yeah. Just watch how quick the water's coming in, guys. And look, my meter's going off. Oh, going into there. I'd say I sort of noticed it more when I was about 18. Probably a bit younger. Right, look how quick the water's coming in. Look, just literally coming straight in. Look at that. And the injections they gave me, the steroids. This is why people get caught out. Literally, I'd say 30 seconds. But then I couldn't walk. And I turned quite ill. It's all full up now. No. So we've, we've got to go. I had a little boy come to me. I'll grab your table, Adam. Oh, um, cheers. Tell me. You said you're gonna be okay. Look how fast that water's moving. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it was a cute little boy, curly hair, and he was in Dumbarine. Oops. Come on, focus. It's just weird how I could remember that. I 
how fast that's coming in. I'm literally walking and it's coming at the speed of me walking. So you can understand why someone so far out will get trapped when they're right out there. Look at that. Oh, that's creeping up. Yeah. Don't realise how fast it's I coming in, do you? Hear it. I knew it. Yeah, I'm on I'm on duty. Look, look at this side. This side's right in. That's how fast the water comes in, guys. Okay, let's get over here, Mum. So you didn't take me up on that off-road, I'm going outside a bit further then. <laughs> 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 They'd be not running with, by now, wouldn't they? Not without his trunks. No. Yeah. <laughs> oh, just take your time, Doris Day. Hey. Just take your time, love. Well, if I walk fast, that's where I'm going to slip over. Oh, I've got the camera running. Come on, let's, let's get 250 quid. <laughs> Stop it. I'm just going to show you in the space of us walking up the causeway, the tide. In those few minutes of us walking up the causeway, the tide is now there, and we were, yeah, just up. I don't know if you can see the post or not. No, you can't see the post. Well, I mean, I can just about see it, but that's where we're at. Um, if I turn it around, that's... What is that? My ghost tube has gone very quiet. Yeah. Um, and, yeah, that's the, the slip ramp there. So that uh, you can see why so many people got caught out. Here comes Tracy. Back as hell. The big light on the head. <laughs> yes. Do you anything there, Rudy? No. Nah, nothing. And you feel like she's still with us? Oh yeah, she's curious of what we do. Oh doing. good. Oh well that's the main thing. Yeah, yeah. She's still there. Well, that's, that's good news. Because um, now we've made that connection, yes. she's like she's granddaughter. Interested. Okay. Granddaughter. Angel, <coughs> there's a little black box just in front of me. That'll give you energy, okay? So he's put his hands in his socks. And your socks, yeah. <laughs> that's it. Right. Maybe. 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 <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> So even though the causeway is a good a foot higher than the oh. silt, yeah, it's yeah. already up to the causeway already. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. The top Amazing. of it that is. So, uh, so quick so coming quick. in. That was quick, wasn't it? It was nice. Probably you could actually here. catch it as well while it was actually happening. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I didn't look at the tides. Just thought I just chance it. I'm scared. I'm scared. scared. Don't be scared. Don't do not be scared. We are here to talk. We are here to help. Related. Related? No, I don't think so. How do you know? Gary. <laughs> yeah, we're good to go. Alright, so we can do white noise or power tech or power lift. Let's try I some white noise. I haven't run. Alright. Try that and talking to um, Angel. Yeah, Angel. Yeah. That's her nickname. Was it? Yeah. She responded to it though. Right. Get over play cards while you might. Go get go and get wet feet, girl. Oh, she, she's pointing to the um uh the boots that she was wearing. Ooh, that's nice. All right. Lovely. Okay, <laughs> Angel, we're gonna give you a method of communication. All right, so you can talk into the little device in my hand. Uh, you might recognise it as a, as a form of a mobile phone, uh, but it's here to help you communicate, OK? Oh. Oh. Angel, are you here with us? Yes. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, Angel. God bless you, darling. Yeah. Are you looking for your brother? 
Andrew, I know, I know it's distressful, but are you looking for your brother? Is your brother named Peter, Andrew? Oh. Sorry, I have to ask you. Are you looking for Peter? Did you get speech, Ray? Did you get speech? Is Peter still on the earth, Ray? No. Speak. Peter's still here, but you can't find him. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah. I know these are hard questions for you, but if you can give us some give us some clarifications, then what we can do is come back with more people and try and bring Peter to you. Do you understand? Is it, uh, I'm wondering if Angel, is, that, is, is your brother's name Peter? I don't know. I don't know. Yep. Angel? Is your brother's name Peter? Believe. Believe. I don't know. I don't know. You don't Believe. know. <laughs> Who's Andrew? Uh, who's Andrew? Is Andrew connected to you? <laughs> Andrew, it's okay. It's okay, you can talk to us. Joe? <laughs> said or no? Huh? So I said no. I thought you said under. Under. Good thing. Did you say under? <laughs> is, is someone else with us, please? How many spirits are there here? How many have joined us here, please? Is there a Ken with us? Is there a note? Yeah. 
people. Can you confirm is there a Ken with this place? Brother is here. Can you step forward, please? Someone get caught digging for bait. Come on. switch over to another rack. Yeah, go to it. Okay, we're going to switch over to something slightly different. Well, we've got some strong um, ones on the uh, angel, anyway. That was a, yeah, which immediately just said yes. Yeah. Um, so. right, we're going to go for Alice. I'm using this for ages. Paralysis. ITC Legion Paralysis loaded. What the hell is you talking <laughs> Freaky voices. Robotic. Scanning. Technology, eh? <laughs> yeah. Just to do a ghost. I've got, got this actually. Angel? Angel, if you're with us, can you uh, give us a sign? Yeah, the tide is, yeah. Yeah, it's coming. Angel? Are you able to give us a sign, please? That's it. I think I can watch. Look, that's it there. Watch. You want us to watch the tide? We're watching the tide, don't we? See worry. how quick it comes in. I'm on tide dune. Yeah. And we're safe up here. Yeah, we have stepped above the way from the tide. We'll top the wall now. We should be safe. Have you noticed the causeway's now filled in? Yeah. Uh, how quick does that go? Is it same? So there's all gone. Yeah. Literally, if you can see that torch, 10 foot in front of it, it's full of water. Full of water. Um, I mean, you know, what tides come and go, but that's... That was quick. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not so sure as quick as that. Is this what happened to you, Angel? That's why you're telling us to watch. Because we moved up, we, we see it coming in and we moved it. Is she still with us? Yeah, she keeps showing me things. Mason. Is that Nathan? Mason. Mason. Oh, Mason. Angel, are you still with us, Angel? Are you still your, here? Was your brother Mason? Is that the name of your brother? Is that a surname? Could be. Could be. Yeah. Are you a Mrs. Mason or Miss Mason? Is Mason your surname, please? Mason is your surname. Could you touch the teddy bear at all? There's a little ball on the teddy bear. <coughs> touch it, that's what will happen. Alright. 
is a is Angel sought for Angela? But Flair. Oh yeah, yeah. 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 Sort of Flair. Yeah. That means someone's out there then. Yeah. Yeah. What's the white flare mean or green flare? I don't know. What? Uh, white flare, just uh, illumination. Angel, it's mate. If Mason was your brother's name, can you touch the teddy bear, please? Or give me a give me a sign on this device. It's all gone quiet, said Dougal. Yeah, she seems to have. Um, I can't feel it so much now. Alright. Oh. Well, I'll, I'll switch to something else and see if we can entice it back. No. Angel, if you're still with us, can you give us a sign, please? Angel? Angel, my darling, would you be able to go some... Angel, would you, um, I know we've asked you a couple of times. We're going to try and give you the opportunity to get now. Could you... Would you try, could you try and give us the name of your brother, please? Father's name Ethan. Is your brother's name Ethan, please? Again, you can use the teddy bears to confirm if you like. Stop. Yeah. Deep. Just take this one. So, can you confirm Ethan is your brother's name, please? Oh no, I, I, I promise you we'll come back and help you. If you can give us a bit more information, and we will let you rest for tonight, and we will come back and get more people. We may be able to help you. Do you understand? Did you understand that? When we come back, we will try and bring your brother through and hope we try and reunite you. Okay? Do you like that? Or would you like that?
Are there any other spirits that drown here, please? Have we got anyone else here that drowned, please? Anyone that... Okay, so just gonna just gonna ask one more time if there's any other spirits that are here, can you give us a name please? Chosen. Okay. Strangle. Strangle. Do you mean choked? Did you choke? No, you're for a minute. What's this going on? So someone choked. You drowned. Any other spirits who wish to make themselves known, you can do so now. And we will promise you we will come back and talk to you again. Who was that? Men. No one here, was it? No. I said female voice. Okay, any more messages at all, please? True. Okay, thank True. you very much. What's that? True. Right. Thank you very much for the spirits that communicated with us tonight. Angel, I promise you, we will return. We'll do all we can. Thank you very much. Getting a bit brisk. <laughs> All right, yeah, we're gonna. I think we'll uh, we'll wrap it up here. Uh, there's gonna be more to come from this place, um, quite clearly. We'll try and get back and do what we can for Angel. Uh, maybe we can bring one or two others who can sort of bring who can bring her in, uh, and hopefully her brother as well. But I think that's going to be the mission objective. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, hopefully everyone else is here. Right, okay, yeah, so we're gonna wrap that one up. Um thank you everybody for joining on us on this cold but uh, clear night for once. And um, we will see you again. Thank you from Tracy Vicky. Rudy and myself. God bless you all, love and Thank you.